Welcome to Backmate, Backstretcher, Beginner, Phase 1. In this beginning phase, you are going to put your lower back on the very utmost part of Backmate. Start by placing both of your feet on the ground with your knees parallel to one another. Make sure that you have your scapula flat on the ground as well. Put your arms out to the side and take a deep breath and relax into the device to elongate your spinal column. You will begin to feel completely relaxed as it makes your spinal column feel longer. Now breathe in and then out. <sighs> Extreme beginners can place a pillow behind their head. As you move into the intermediate phases to advance, you can remove the pillow. Welcome to Backmate Backstretcher Intermediate Phase 2. Start off with your bottom at the very top of the device, then scooch down halfway on the device. Not all the way down to the ground, that's the advanced level. This position will allow you to have a higher arch in the lumbar spine. Place both arms on the side of your body and take a deep breath in. And then out, letting your spine relax all the way down. If this is feeling nice and you want a little bit more, make this level intermediate plus by placing both arms over your head. This will make your spine feel even more elongated and you will really feel your vertebrae open up. Now take a deep breath in and then release it. <sighs> Welcome to Backmate Backstretcher Advanced Phase 3. Now if you want to move into a more advanced posture, start with placing your bottom on the floor. This is for people who really know their body. Ensure your bottom is touching the very base of the device, making them both flush with one another. Your knees should be at a parallel bent angle. Now in your current position, lay over the device. Go down to your elbows first. You don't want to go all the way to your scapula because you want to let your body relax into it. Always go elbows down first and then go back all the way until you reach your desired elongation. If you are an advanced yogi or an experienced athlete or somebody who is very flexible, you are going to want to go all the way back and open up your scapula by putting your arms in a T-pose with both feet flat on the floor. Now breathe in and out. <sighs> to really kick things up a notch, lower your legs down all the way straight and you can put your arms back all the way up towards your ears. Now flatten all the way across the device and take a deep breath in and then release. If your scapula is touching, you can completely relax your body. If your bottom is touching, your heels are touching and you are 100% straight as a board with your arms up towards your ears and your feet all the way out straight. Once you feel comfortable in this position, you are going to want to move your bottom towards your ankles. You might feel a little small ouch at first, but as you breathe deeply in and out, the ouch becomes an ah. This device is going to help relax your spine and it's going to help you feel the elongation in your spine. All the stress in your lower lumbar should feel released and that's amazing. Enjoy your new, beautifully relaxed body.